Hello, Michel. Hello, teacher. How are you? Uh, fine, thank you. Excellent. And you? I think fine, also. <laughs> okay, um, uh, we're uh, gonna wait for your other classmates a few minutes and then we're right, okay? Okay. They are joining right now. Hello, hello guys. How are you? Hi, and you? Excellent, I think. Better than yesterday. <laughs> yesterday was a chaos. But everything is fine today. Thank you. Okay, I'm going to take the attendance list and then we're going to start our class. Okay? So say something when you hear your name, please. Let me see. Who's here? Catherine? Catherine Julissa, right? Yes, here. Okay, okay. Thank you. Let me see who else is here. Jacqueline? No, right? Fatima. Fatima Paola? Here. Okay, excellent. Who else is here? Michelle. Where is Michelle? Michelle, Michelle, Michelle. Well, Kevin Estuardo is here. Jacqueline Michelle. Okay. Thank you. Jacqueline Michelle, right? Hey, yes. Okay, okay. I don't know if it's somebody else here. Oscar. Oscar and Sofia Sibet. Present, Miss. Okay, thank Present. you. Both Present. are okay, don't worry. Okay, Oscar and Sofia. Jacqueline Sofia, right? Yes. Okay, thank you. So I'm, I'm gonna, I want to apologize because of yesterday. It was uh, because of my connection, so sorry for that. So right now I'm gonna share my screen and please let me know if you can see it. Can you? Your background, it's funny. <laughs> I like it. Okay, so I'm noticed that you can you can see it or no. All of you are able to see the screen. Yes, no, maybe. I am not here. Can you see? Can you see and hear? Yes. Yes. Okay. 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 Pay attention, please. Just actor. Just vocabulary about jobs and occupations. An actor acts in a play. Artist. An artist makes art. Astronaut. An astronaut explores space. Bus driver. A bus driver drives buses. Taxi driver. A taxi driver drives a taxi. Businessman. A businessman is good at dealing with business. Carpenter. Mi tarea no, es facilitar la universidad porque los alumnos tienen que lidiar con. Perdón, profe. 
It's carpenter. not premium. <laughs> A carpenter makes things from wood. Cashier. A cashier takes in or gives out money. Coach. A coach trained a sports team. Computer programmer. A computer programmer creates computer programs. Chef. A chef prepares and cooks food. Baker. A baker makes bread and cakes. Waiter. A waiter serves people food and drink. Doctor. A doctor looks after people's health. Nurse. A nurse takes care of sick people. Electrician. An electrician repairs electrical equipment. Plumber. A plumber repairs water systems or pipes. Engineer. An engineer designs and builds machines, systems, or structures. Road worker. A road worker helps build and repair roads. Gardener. A gardener takes care of the plants in the garden. Farmer. A farmer runs a farm. Firefighter. A firefighter puts out fires. Hairdresser. A hairdresser cuts and shapes hair. Judge. A judge is a person who judges and sentences people. Lawyer. A lawyer defends people and gives legal advice. Lifeguard. A lifeguard protects swimmers from drowning. Mechanic. A mechanic repairs machines, especially car motors. Musician. A musician writes, sings, or plays music. Painter. A painter has the job to paint walls or houses. Photographer. A photographer takes photos. Pilot. A pilot flies an airplane or a helicopter. Police officer. A police officer enforces law, investigates crimes, and makes arrests. Reporter. A reporter tells people the news on radio or television. Cameraman. A cameraman uses a camera to film something. Secretary. A secretary's job is to arrange appointments, write letters and organize meetings. Hello. Security guard. A security guard's job is to guard a place. Singer. A singer is a performer who sings. Soccer player. A soccer player is a person who plays soccer. Tailor. A tailor makes clothes for others. Teacher. A teacher's job is to teach students about certain subjects. Flight attendant. A flight attendant helps passengers who are traveling in an airplane. 
Train Conductor A train conductor collects money or tickets from passengers. Vet A vet is an animal doctor. Scientist A scientist does scientific research and many experiments. Dentist A dentist looks after people's teeth. Pharmacist A pharmacist prepares and sells drugs and medicines. Ballet dancer A ballet dancer is someone who dances in ballets. Delivery man A delivery man delivers goods to customers. Postman A postman delivers the mail to homes. Librarian A librarian is a person who works in a library. Sailor A sailor is a person who works on a boat or ship. Magician A magician is a performer who does tricks for entertainment. Optometrist An optometrist examines people's eyes. Architect An architect designs buildings. Housekeeper A housekeeper's job is to cook, clean, and look after a house. Actor Artist Okay, so the idea is that you learn new vocabulary to be able to express or ask the occupations or jobs of somebody else or to talk about you. So I don't know if there is a new vocabulary that you learned today. Something new, something that you didn't know the, the meaning or even the vocabulary, how to say something. Can you repeat? Um, no. No? Okay, okay. I want to tell you something and here in the in the video it's no mention, but waiter for it's it's this one. But for men, waitress, it's for women, okay? So if you are, if you have this job, make sure that you do this clarification, okay? So if you are a waiter or a waitress, okay? So keep in mind this because we're gonna learn something relative, like that has a relation with this. So, give me a second. Please let me know if you can see. Can you? Okay. So, we're going to learn about um, positive adjectives, okay? And this is easy, I promise you. And if you already watched the video yesterday, it will be easier. So let me see. Miguel, help me read, please. Also see adjectives or adjectives. No. My, their, your, your, his, here. Okay, thank you. Just um, your, your, like e, your. And this is for like two or more. And this is when I have a conversation with you. Okay. And the pronunciation of this one, it's her. Do you know what's the meaning of uh, those words? The meaning, I'm going to put it. Meaning. 
do you know what's the meaning of my, their, your, his, or her? Don't worry if you say no, because we're going to learn about this. Okay, Catherine, I am not sure, but you say no, right? It's because you have your microphone off. Yes, Oscar, um, her, it's for a woman. They are, but I'm gonna explain you because I don't want to confuse you. We use the positive attitudes to talk or to express that something it's mine, my cup, my cell phone. I don't have but my car. So I am saying that I have a possession, a possession, possession. So for example, if I say, uh, if I want to say, give me a second. That Michelle, Michelle has glasses, right? A pair of glasses. So they are hair glasses. Why? Because it's a possession of Michelle. Okay. If I say that, let me see who's here. Oscar, we're gonna talk about Oscar. If I say that Oscar has a blue T shirt, is his T shirt. Wait, what's that? T shirt. Why? It's because it's his, it's used for men. I'm gonna show you. Give me a sec. Here, when I want to talk about my possession, I'm gonna use mine. This is for I, when I talk about me. When I want to talk about you, your possession, Oscar, or your possession, Michelle, I'm gonna say your glasses. I, something like, I like your glasses, Michelle, okay? I like them. It's your possession, okay? Continue. If I want to talk about he, his t-shirt. If I want to talk about she, her glasses, her shirt. If I want to talk about an object, her what? About my laptop. It's mouse because it's a possession of my laptop. We're going to say like that. So this is not working. The mouse is not working. <laughs> so if I want to talk about all of us, our class, why? Because it includes you and me. If I want to talk about you, but in plural, which is equal to say ustedes, I'm going to use your. It's the same here. Function for singular and plural. You, you. And finally, if, for example, if Sophia is talking with me about her classmates, we're going to say, oh, they, they are, I don't know, happy and because they have an English class. So their English class. This is their possession. So here 
it, it, it's, I think it's clear, clearer here. Mine, there, this not includes me. Your, your, which is for singular, his, which I am talking about, his friends, his uh, motorcycles, his cars, I don't know. Her, her friends, her car or her cards. So, is it clear? Do you understand? Yes, perfect. Okay. So, you are going to try to make sentence. Don't worry if you if you feel that it's not too too good, too bad. We are going to learn together, okay? So, Fatima, can you give me a sentence? You choose the, the possessive adjective. Don't worry. Uh, cualquiera? Yes. Your book. Your book. Okay. Mm -hmm. You are talking about me, right? Because you are having a conversation with me. Okay. Your book. Very good. Okay. Your book is yellow. Here we go. Okay. Let me see. Katani, can you give me an example? Her blue pants is beautiful. Blue pants. Oh, fine. <laughs> pants is beautiful. Beautiful. Okay. In this case, we use R because it's plural, pants. We always say pants or jeans or treasures. You cannot say jean, just jeans, because we have two legs. I don't understand the logic, but it's for that. So her blue pants. Okay, thank you. Kevin, can you give me another sentence? My job is um, coffee, color coffee. Your what? Job. A dog. Ah, uh, I was thinking like a job <laughs> with color. My dog <laughs> is brown. Coffee, it's the drinking. Ah, uh, brown. Brown. Yeah. Uh huh. To talk about colors, we use brown. So same, uh, it's the same with eyes or, or hair, okay? My dog, it's brown, very good, okay. This is your possession, her possession about she and your possession about you, you, her, she, I, okay, I noticed that you yesterday made some mistakes about this. My brother, okay, it's my possession, it's my brother, so I am talking about I, because it's my possession, my brother. But if I say my brother is handsome, nobody believes. My brother is handsome. I'm talking about he, because, you know, the, the, the center of the sentence is my brother. But understand that this is, my possession, okay? If I say his, talking about my brother, his sister is beautiful, okay? Beautiful and dyslexical. 
his sister is beautiful, I am talking about me, about his possession. Do you understand, understand the difference? Yes. Very good. Yes. Do you have any doubt about this or this? I don't know, something like, teacher, I don't understand, or teacher, I don't know what's the meaning of, of they, or their, I don't know, or the pronunciation? No? Is everything clear? Very good. Okay, here you have uh, more examples. So please let me see uh, who's here. Emmanuel, are you there? No? Okay, Ruben, I know that you are here. You have to be here. You say that you are here. Yes, teacher. Very good. Okay, so help me read, please. Mm. I mean, all the... the uh, subject pronoun. I have a dog. Uh, um, my dog is big. You have a dog. Your dog is big. He has a dog. His dog is big. She has a dog. Her. Continue. Her, continue. Her dog is big. It has a dog. Its dog is big. We have a dog. Our dog is big. They have a dog. Their dog is big. Okay, thank you. Just the pronunciation. It's like an E. Your. Your. Your, mm -hmm. your, your, dog. your, your dog. dog. Very good. So those are just examples to clarify the, 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 the examples, you know, talking about I or my possession, I use my, and so on, okay? So give me a second. So here I have some examples. Let me see. Uh, Michelle, help me read, please. My friends, he's a smart. My friends, mm, no sé cómo sería, my, my, ¿verdad? <laughs> Which one? Which? Here, my friend. My pronunciation. Oh, my. yes, yes, <laughs> my, very good pronunciation. Okay, my friend is a uh, smart. Oh, here is a mistake. Give me a second. In this sentence, it's a mistake. Is it smart? Yes, it's smart, just smart. My bad, sorry. Okay, continue. Her brothers are twins. Your friends are mm, 19 years old. 19. 19 years old. Very good. His, his classmates are Tom and Jim. And Jim. Okay, thank you. So, do you know what's the meaning of twins? Yes? Okay. They are brothers that are equal. Okay, just in case if you know. So, here I have some examples. And here are more examples. Miguel, help me read, please. Okay. Our friends are fantastic. Its roof is red. Their car is expensive. Thank you. Okay. Do you know what or why, sorry, I am using its roof is red? No? You don't have any idea? No. No? Okay. It's because, I don't know if you remember, but we were talking that it 
it's for animals or animals or objects. Okay, so this is my dog. So it's it's the possession of my dog. My dog has a roof. This is the roof, the red one. The roof. Okay. My dog has a roof. A house with a roof. I don't know. So I am talking about the possession. It's why? Because we say that we use for it, we use its. So because I am talking about my dog, I am going to use its. Its roof is color red. Okay? Mm -hmm. Exactly. Just because of that. It's the pulsation of my dog. In my dog, it's an animal. Very good. So any doubt about this point? Because we're going to practice. No? Okay. Okay, I have a link for you. I'm going to share it. You can see it, right? Thank you. I'm going to sec. This is low. Okay, so if you notice, there is a list. And the only thing that you have to do is to click here, the correct one, okay? Easy. So who wants to be the first one? The only thing that you have to do is to replace. If here I am talking about my sister, I'm gonna use she. Why? Because my sister, it's a woman, okay? So who wants to be the first one? Oscar, Oscar, you say yes, I want. Okay, perfect. So you will be the first one. You're gonna start with your car. Which uh, do you think it's no. the car? The? Is, is he? He, okay. Yes. Do you agree? All of you agree? Agree is to... Be okay with the answer. Agree. Agree or de acuerdo. Okay. Agree? Yes. Yes or no? I'm noticing yes. that Kevin is not sure. Remember, all of you have to be sure about your answers. If you say this is okay, it's okay. And then we're going to check it. So don't worry. OK. Is it OK? OK, Kevin, you will be the next one. This man, am I talking about she, it, or he? Um, this man. She, I. She, this. He. Ah, he. Okay. Mm -hmm. So I have your car and this man the same. Okay. Fatima. London. Oh. We, he, or it. <clears throat> it's it? okay okay sorry i have some problems with the audio okay thank you so michelle my sister and me i have these options it we or he we we very good okay miguel your mom and dad Your mom 
in that. I'm going to show you the answers. We, they, you. They. They. Very good. Your mom and dad. Okay, Catherine. My hair. It, I, or she? I. I. Okay. Um, Sophia, are you there? My hair. His mother. His mother. Mother. He. It. Or she. she. This one. She. She. Okay. Very. Good. Thank you. Emmanuel, are you there? Uh, Seria Paul. Paul and Mary. In Mary. We uh, day, day or you? Day. Day. Okay. Thank you. Jared. Are you there? Preach. No? Okay, Ruben. Mm. Preach, it's the city, Praga. It, she, or I. Mm. I, I will. Hi. Okay, thank you. Okay. Uh, yes, Oscar, go ahead. Tell me. Uh, uh, Praga of Republica Checa? Praga. I, uh -huh. I, I, I know that it's Praga. Preach. But equal, they are cities. So we are talking about uh -huh. objects. Uh -huh. so ah, ciudad, that's... ¿verdad? Praga uh -huh. de ciudad. Uh -huh. oh, okay. Uh -huh. okay. So we're going to continue. Let me see. We finished. So we're going to restart with Oscar. Um, here, your dog. It, he, or she? Is he. He? Okay. Yes. Nicolas and me. Let me see. Michelle? We oh, very good. Now without without showing the answers, the options. Fatima, Mr. Janssen. Um he. Ah, oh, very good. He. Okay. Miguel, their pardon. Their pardon. I don't know if, if you're talking, but you're mute. Uh, you? You? Okay. Thank you. Kevin, her brother. She? Okay. Our house. Uh, let me see. Uh, Sophia. Hi. Our house. Uh, our house? Our house? It. There we go. Okay. Ruben. Next one. He. He. Uh -huh, he. Okay. Okay. Uh, John's father. Let me see. Catherine. I don't know. Catherine is here. No, oh, she's not here right now. Oh, yes. It's here. Sorry. <laughs> so, Catherine. Next one. Mm. He. Okay. Very good. Emmanuel, are you there? She. She. Oh, but we, no. we, oh, okay. we don't have here the options. Okay. <laughs> uh, seria the options you? are okay. You. Okay. Thank you. Uh, Jared, I don't know if you're here. If not, we can continue. Fatima? Next one. Okay, very good, very good. 
Ok, next one, let me see. Oscar. Uh, is uh, my, is uh, I. Oh, but we, we don't have here this one. You don't, this. Have, you, you don't have to be careful uh, to be or to pay attention on the preposition. Because you're, if not in the, in the possession. Here, uh, for example, our house, if you notice, it's it, because I am talking about the possession. So a house, it's an object. So that's why my bicycle, it's an object. So here we have it, okay? It, uh -huh. okay. Very good. Okay, Miguel, her black shoes. Next one. She? Okay. Ah, the battery. Give me a sec. Give me a sec. Give me a sec. Okay. She, say, right? Oh, we don't have she. We have a problem here. You are paying attention on the possessive adjective and not on the possession. If I say, or if I am talking about her black shoes, I am talking about what? About her, about she, or about the object, the shoes? The mm. options are we, they, and I. I. Okay. Okay. I. Our school, Fatima. Who? She. Who? Okay. Yes, Michelle. Tengo una duda, pero no sé. ¿Lo puedo preguntar en español? <laughs> yes, of course. Tell me. Um, creo que en ese espacio de her black shoes. Uh -huh. Me acabo de dar cuenta de que de plano no entendí el ejercicio porque las opciones que da, no sé. Okay. Porque o sea, Black Shoes es un objeto. Ajá. Entonces, pienso que debería referir, o sea, el pronombre personal sería. Should it, be ¿verdad? it, right? But if it is in plural, we talk about them in plural. So, they. It's plural also about objects. Mm, no. So yes. in that case, the correct option is they, because I am talking about the objects. So because of the object, it's in plural. Shoes, we never say shoe. Shoe, it's like shoe, shoe. We, we arriar la gallinas. But <laughs> we here, I'm talking about shoes in plural, so we talk about they, okay? And finally, we have here, uh, let me see, Sofia, students and their teacher. Uh, their. Very good. Students and their teacher. Okay, we're gonna check it. We're gonna notice if you watched the video yesterday. Mm -hmm. We have some of them rooms. If I am talking about the car and it's in singular, the correct option is it, because this is an object, okay? And here we talk, I'm gonna see. Oh, this is not the correct one. Here, remember, we are, we are mixing positive adjectives, subjects. So if I say, give me a second. If I talk about it, it's because I am talking about an object. In this one, my hair, 
Is it a person or an object? Like my finger. Object. Very good. So it's it. Okay. Uh... Here, Prech, it's a city. La ciudad de Praga. Okay. So for city, for, for like countries, cities, because they are like objects, we use it. Okay. It, it's the opposite of person, of people. So, dog, it's an animal. It's the opposite of a, of a person. So, dog, it's an animal, and we use it for animals, okay? We also have Nicolas and me. Very good. This is okay. This is okay. Pardon. Plural. So, they, I am talking about they, about your parents. Same case here. Yes, Oscar. Solo una, una pregunta. ¿Qué? Que una cierta duda. Que, entonces, el ejercicio es referente a quien se está dirigiendo en el mensaje, ¿verdad? No mayormente. El, this is mixed. Here, you are paying attention on this but also on this. In the next exercise, you're gonna be focused just on possessive attitudes. But here, you're starting um, like, in a, like in a stranger way, the, the subject. But because I want that you manage all this and not just the possessives. So yes, those are me. But in the next one, you're going to be focused on positive, okay? So also here, brother, it's he, because it's a man. He, this is different. Mr. Johnson, Mr., it's a man. But if you notice here, an S becomes in a girl, okay? So this is maybe a teacher, a teacher, a woman, a woman teacher. And finally here, Mary's brother, I'm talking about the possession of Mary, which is the brother in their sister. So they are plural. That's why we use they, not you, okay? We're gonna continue to clarify all these, don't worry. We're gonna have more examples. Okay. Right now, you are gonna be separated by, oh, you baby. <laughs> you're gonna be separated by uh, groups or by pairs. So you're gonna talk about one person. It could be your boyfriend, your husband, your girlfriend, your wife, your brother, sister, mother, father, or babies also, your son. So this is like an example. My brother, it's David. He's tall and handsome. He's funny and he's 25 years old. He is a farmer. That's why I have a cow. My brother, it's T and my brother has green eyes. Okay. If you notice here, I am talking, I am mixing. He like the subject because I am talking about a man, but this is my possession. I can also add his cow because he has a cow. Give me a second. His cow is a brown and brown. Its name is caramelo and blah, 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 blah. Here, I am talking about my brother's possession, which is the cow. Here, it's a name. I am talking about the name of the cow. Why? Because it's, I'm using it's. It is the possessive adjective of an animal, okay? Do you know what's the meaning of cow? No, I'm gonna I'm gonna put it here. Aha. Okay. Uh -huh. 
-hmm. So my brother has a cow. I'm going to show you this is a cow. Is this one? Okay. So here I'm talking about the name of, of my cow, which is Caramelo. So you can continue. Now you are going to talk with your classmates about one person. It could be your brother, your sister, your son, your wife, I don't know, whatever. And you're going to bring details about that person. Here I am talking about my brother. So I give details about my brother. Is it clear or no? Do you understand? So, so, Kevin? So, so. Okay. The only thing that you have to do is to talk about one person. It could be, do you have brothers? No? Yes. Okay, so you can talk about your brother. Or if you want to talk about your girlfriend, you can talk about your girlfriend. You choose, okay? You select the person and talk about this person, okay? So do you know what, what it's the meaning of breakup rooms? No? Los no, entendí. Okay, give me a second. Los breakup rooms son cuartitos separados de la de la reunión principal. Entonces, a ustedes se les va a enviar una notificación ahorita mismo. Eh, yo les voy a crear, creo que van a estar en pareja para que tengan la oportunidad de hablar. Van a estar en parejitas y van a estar hablando sobre la persona de la que ustedes quieren estar hablando. One group will be of three. The rest will be in Payers, ok, payers. So, ahorita van a recibir una, una notificación que dice, usted ha sido invitado o you, has been, uh, you have been invited to break up room one or break up room two. So you click on accept, something like that, and you will be moving for that room. Ustedes van a estar en ese, en ese otro cuartito con otras personas. Ok, go please and talk. Disculpe, solo para aclarar. Yes. Eh, en esos cuartitos vamos a estar eh, hablando de alguna persona que hayamos escogido. Uh -huh. A ver, gracias. Ok. So, please join. Si no han re recibido la notificación, me avisan. Ok. Um, you, you have a brother or sister? Yes, I have four brothers. Um, and you? Uh, yes, I wanna. I want have no. I have one a sister. It's a uh, more. Uh, Es más grande que yo, no sé cómo decir. Ya es mayor que yo. Is taller than me. 
¿Cómo? Is taller than me. Taller. Tall. Ah. Okay. Mm. Ah. I saw, uh, ah, yeah. uh, Okay, continue talking okay. about the person that you select. Please continue. Um, uh, eh, yes, I am. And okay. I heard in Spanish. <laughs> My goodness, what's that? <laughs> Please try to speak in, in English, okay? You, the only thing that you have to do is to talk about somebody that you select, okay? Somebody, what? Or also you can talk about you, Fatima, talk about Fatima, Sophie, talk about Sophie, or Emmanuel, talk about Emmanuel, if, if it's yeah. easy for you. Okay. My name is Sophia. I have. Hi. Hi. I continue. I am not here. Continue. Okay. <laughs> My mom has her brain fully. And brown color. No. Oh, sí. <laughs> um, she likes the movies, the flowers, the babies. <laughs> <laughs> um, um, um. Hello, are you talking? Are yes, you teacher. practicing? Okay, so yes. are you practicing in mute? <laughs> uh, yes. Ah, uh, yes. You are practicing yes. in mute. It's, it's practicing in... In your mind. In <laughs> one, oh, okay. minute. one minute. <laughs> ah, okay, okay. So you also can talk about you if you want. Oscar talk about Oscar and Ruben talk about Ruben. Give information about you, your personal information, okay? Okay. Um, uh, Ruben, you're um, 28 years old. Is your engineer. Give me, give me a second. Uh, if you want to talk about you, you say, I am, I have, I blah, blah, blah but you use the subject I, okay? For example, if Fatima talk about Fatima, which is me, uh, I am 22 years old, I have brown hair, brown eyes, and continue, okay? Ah, mm -hmm. um, sobre nosotros. Yes, Oscar talk ah. about yourself and Ruben talk about yourself. Ah, ah. <laughs> uh -huh. Um, for example, um, uh, I, or, or my phone is blue. Very yes, good. Uh, okay. You can continue. Is my, my class, my class of my English class is very dynamics very very dynamics i'm not a some sarcasm mm -hmm. in in your sentence i don't know why <laughs> <laughs> i hope no but i am not <laughs> um uh, for me i like it okay excellent okay and what about you Rodri? Uh, ruben ah, sorry can you talk about yourself? Mm. 
I I my am my a dog. A doctor. Yes. Ah, okay. Okay. <laughs> Continue. I have uh I have uh, the bees. A what? What you have what, Ruben? No sé si está bien. I I have I have uh what do you want to say? Como una clínica? No, le fui a la playa, no no se ocupa I have. Ah, no, I went. Oh, I, have. I went to the beach. Ah, uh, I went to the, the beach. Ah, very good. Okay. Um have is tengo. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. So if you want, we're going to stop here because I want to give you feedback for all of you, your classmates and you. So we are going to come back to the main session, okay? Okay. okay. This meeting is being recorded. Hello, Catherine. Hi. Did you practice? Yes. Okay, very good. That's right. That's something good. Okay, we're gonna wait for your uh, other classmates and then I, I just wanted to give you feedback, okay? Hello, Miguel and Michelle. Hello. Hello. We, we Hello. are waiting for your... Hello. We're waiting for your other classmates. And then I'm going to give you feedback. Give me a sec. Okay, I think we are almost complete. I don't know why the rest, it's not here, but I'm gonna send you the feedback. Check the chat, please. If you want to talk about a physical description, you say, my mom has curly, colochito, curly hair, or straight, straight, straight hair, or also, um, what else? You can also talk about the color, brown, dark, if you want to talk about the, 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 the black. You, it's better if you say dark hair, okay? Dark instead of black. And also, feedback for you, pay attention. If you say, I am a dog, what do you hear? I am a dog. I am a dog. What do you hear? Aha, <laughs> aha. Uh -huh. uh -huh. If I say, 
I am a dog. I am gonna hear or think that you are a dog, a, a puppy, you know? <laughs> so if you want to talk about a dog tree, uh, if you want to make contractions, make sure that you pronounce very well the last letter, because if not, this can be a confusion. If, if you want to talk about a dog tree, I don't know, you can even say the, 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 the voice of Bugs Bunny. Mm, I am a duck <laughs> and I can understand you better. Okay, so just to be careful with this because you have to learn to pronounce very well the ending of a letter or a word, okay? So if you want to talk about that you are, uh, about your profession, it's better if you use it in the complete way. I am a doctor, okay? Okay, or I am a doc. I take care of people. So now I understand that you are not a doc, okay? And also, if you want to talk about something that you like to do, I like to go to the beach, I like to go camping, I like to eat pupusas, I like to eat or to drink a tolchuco, and so on, okay? So this is just feedback. I'm so sorry to take more minutes of your class, but I always try to, to give you feedback because you know it's better if you practice and also know what you have to, 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 to fix, to change, to modify, okay, or to improve. So I want to give you some homework. The only thing that you have to do is to introduce yourself, okay? Create a conversation, introducing yourself using the subject, I am, blah, 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 the verb to be, I am, am, it's the verb to be, or is, or um, are, I am, you are, he is, okay? And the possessive adjective, my name is Fatima Marroquin. My hobby is give classes, I don't know, something, okay? Or I like to prepare classes, I don't know. The idea is that you introduce yourself. You do this in the WhatsApp group or in a private message, okay? Yes, Kathleen. Eh, la tarea es para mañana. You have, uh, I will give you before, the, the the next class, so before 6 p.m. of tomorrow. You can you can send the audio right now, or I don't know, during tomorrow day, or I don't know, but before the class, because the idea is that you practice before to have another class, okay? Y sería una sola usando los tres que están ahí, va. Sí, sí. Si se fijan, la verdad es que está facilito. Ustedes ocupan el sujeto, lo ocupan con el hello, I am Fátima. El, el verbo to be también lo ocupan con I am, yo soy o yo estoy. Y el possessive adjective con mi nombre es, mi hobby favorito es, mi, mm, mi perro se llama no sé qué, eh, mi perro se llama Canelo, o Firulais, I don't know, something. But you are practicing and this is easy. What's number? I don't understand the, the, the question, Oscar. You can send it to the WhatsApp group or in a private message for me. Both are okay. Okay? Yes. Perfect. Yes. Also, I'm gonna share with you the screen, the, the, the PDF if you need. This is an example. I am Fatima, I am 23 years old, I am a teacher, I'm an intelligent woman, blah, 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 blah. Okay, this is a way to introduce yourself. Any doubt? Is it clear? Agree. Clear. Okay, very good. So I'm going to